Alright, I don't know what this guy's called. Um, this is an Elgab toy. Um, let me know what you guys if you guys know the name. I tried to do like a quick five minute research on Tramped and I could not find it um, based on the Elgab artist. So let me know what you guys know uh, what this guy's name is and I really appreciate it when you do find out. Um, and just put it in the comment section, just let me know what the name is. I'll update the name for the uh, title for this uh, video. Right, uh, this guy is probably my favorite uh, color uh, that Elagav has made. Uh, like the, my, the favorite um, color way, or the way that he colors paints the, the toy. So, not so much about the sculpt itself, but just the paint application. Um, I really like it because it reminds me of like popsicles. And the rainbow colors are very nice and very vibrant. Um, the spacing between the colors are very good as well, uh, which makes it, me really enjoy looking at this toy itself. Um, the sculpt, though, uh, is quite cool. It's also really fun to play with. Um, it's a, a, there's asymmetrical faces. Um, the width between the arms are also asymmetrical, uh, which makes it very cool as well. And what I really like about this toy. And the, the top part makes it really a little bit like icky, um, but also really goofy. So I do enjoy that as well. Um, what I really like about this toy is the fact that um, it has bedazzles on it. Um, it's got little crystals on these uh, points. Uh, some of the older, or some of the yeah, some of the older um, Elagab toys do have that. And instead of just painting the uh, middle of the eyes, he does actually uh, bedazzle his toys. I really do enjoy that. I feel like it gives it a little bit more soul and uh, makes it feel a bit more special. Um, now, I, uh, nowadays, I don't see that happening as much uh, with his toys. Now, this guy's made in a glow-in-the-dark vinyl. Uh, the glow-in-the-dark is still going on quite strong. And um, yeah, uh, it has these kind of like goopy droopy um, lines there, uh, which is very cool. I do enjoy that kind of sculpt. And I, do, I really like the color transition from yellow to pink uh, within these within this, these kind of parts there. Uh, it's done quite well and I very much enjoy it. Uh, the silver rays are good. It does highlight a little bit and gives it a little bit of a difference and it makes the toy a bit more shiny, uh, which is always nice. And uh, it has a lot of posability. You can do a lot of things with it. Uh, despite the fact that there's only three um, kind of articulations, it does feel really fun to move around and uh, mess around with. Because uh, it does look like it's moving its head. This kind of makes it feel like its head and these are its arms. So displaying wise, there's a lot of display possibilities. Uh, I usually try and display it with like different, um, these two arms at different elevations and have it tilted in a slight way so it looks like it's looking at something. So yeah, this guy is um, one of the, the Elagab toy and uh, this is the bottom of it. It looks like it's supposed to be like, an, like a sauce, like an alien, but it, or like the mouth of it, I don't know. But very much, very happy with this guy. Uh, I've actually had him for a while. I just never gotten around to doing a video of him. So yeah, uh, let me know what you guys think. Actually, let me know what your favorite sculpt is for Elagab and uh, in the comment section below. And also, um, what what colorway do you like? Because with Elagab, I found that with different um, base vinyl colors, he has a set color um, palette that he uses. So for glow and dark, he has a set color palette. For black ones, for dark ones, he has a set color palette. For the red ones, he does as well. So yeah, let me know which is your favorite, um, uh, I guess, base vinyl or the color palette that you prefer from Elagab. And um, and if you guys do try and collect just one colorway, like if you just try and collect Elagab's glow in the dark toys, because I know one guy does. So yeah, thanks. Um, hope you guys enjoyed and like and subscribe. Bye bye.